Hey guys, it's Andrew, and if you live in somewhere that is not Australia, then you're probably on summer break right now. Wow, congrats. If you do live in Australia and you are on summer break, then I'm sorry. I thought you guys were not having summer. I don't know everything. But either ways, we are now in July, which means we are in the long stretch of summer break. Long stretch? Wait. Home stretch? End stretch? Seventh inning stretch. Baseball! Okay. But as we approach the second half of summer, you may be running out of things to do, or maybe you're getting bored. So earlier today, I made a little list. Don't know why I'm doing that motion, because I typed it on my phone. 2013. But yes, I have compiled a list of things for you to do over summer break. And I hope that you guys will take these and do them, or maybe they will prompt you to do other things that will make you less bored. So here is a list of fun things for you to do that are all legal. Well, I think they're all legal. Actually, I'm not sure. Get a tattoo of Paula Deen's face on your face. Get a tattoo of Paula Deen's face on your butt. Stare straight into the sun. Complain about how your eyes hurt after staring straight into the sun. Read a book. Make a list of other things that you probably won't do. Go watch a sunset or a sunrise. Or just go Google pictures of a sunset slash sunrise. Or Bing pictures of a sunset or sunrise. Try to learn how to twerk. Complain about not being able to twerk. Go to a bookstore. Ask yourself why you just went to a bookstore. Do some of your required summer work for school. Oh sh Go to a grocery store and smash all the egg cartons. Leave that grocery store very fast. Run, shave your head, and then get a weave installed. Experiment with different brands of deodorant. Have a yard sale. Have a literal yard sale. Sell your grass. Complain about not having a yard anymore. Learn how to make a duct tape wallet. Learn how to make a duct tape hat. Make a whole outfit out of duct tape. Walk around in public with it on and try to get sponsored by the brand duct tape. Go to a park alone. Leave the park so you don't get murdered. Buy a lot of gnomes and place them around your room for a scenery change. Instead of showering, just cover yourself with soap and then throw water balloons at yourself. Complain about having to pick up all the water balloon pieces. Cut Cut your eyebrows off. Go to a tanning bed with all of your clothes on. Protest on someone's lawn. Poop on someone's lawn. Say sorry and then walk off of their lawn. Go bowling. Eat a bowl of cereal. Eat a bag of cereal. Go to Canada and drink a bag of milk. Complain about how Canadians put their milk in bags. Go back to school shopping. Complain about going back to school shopping. Stab yourself with your new school supplies and cry because School. Go to Walmart. Start crying in the middle of Walmart. Leave Walmart and go to Target. Go to the radio section and then turn on all of the radios on full volume. Complain about how every radio is on full volume. Cry in the middle of Target. Make some homemade soap. Take a trip to an elderly home. Take a trip to another country. Take a trip to your kitchen. Well guys, that is just a few of the many things that you can do to spice up your summer break a little bit. Wow, that was a lot of valuable information. I hope you guys took some notes. Or I guess you could just watch the video again. Wow, technology. So that is all for this video. I will see you guys next week. Please remember to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe if you are not already. Goodbye. Now the hard part of this video is going to be deciding whether to name it things to do over summer or things to complain about over summer.